Six Ouch. Superstar Battle Royal. If oh, it was man. me, I'd start this thing by going right after the biggest competitor, then worry about the rest of the field. Ah, oh, the old European uppercut. Oh, you cannot take your eyes off him for a second. Really? What a slam! Impactful. It'll jar your spine. Hey, hey, you're gonna get yourself disqualified. Close line! You gotta believe this one's over. Oh, what an... Oh, targeting the stomach. Attack to the midsection. He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. Oh, targeting the stomach. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially rebounds. Yikes. What a punch! Overhand right lands. Nailed it. In my opinion, Bray Wyatt has got to get back into this. Wow. What are your thoughts? Guys, this is where we find out what oh, he's man. made of. With so much mass in the ring at the same time, bodies have a way of getting beaten and broken, and that's exactly what's happening to him right now. One of the most intense six-man battle royals I've ever witnessed took place on SmackDown in 2008. It was Jeff Hardy, Big Show, Great Khali, Umaga, MVP, and Mr. Kennedy all throwing down to see who would be the number one contender for the WWE Championship. The winner would take on then WWE Champion, Triple H. The six-man battle royal on SmackDown was an exciting time. Corey, just to help put things in perspective, WWE officials had to order the ring to be reinforced for this matchup because between the six superstars, there was more than three quarters of a ton of humanity in the ring. That was not more obvious than when Big Show battled Umaga and the great Khali. One by one, the field cleared. The WWE Universe became unglued when Jeff Hardy eliminated the Big Show with a hurry Con Rana over the top rope. With the great... Here he goes. You know, guys, it's not uncommon for Super... Harsh impact. I'm not sure how much he has left. That should do it, Cole. There's no coming back from a slam of that magnitude. Oh, nasty impact. Drop across the throat. Down they go. Goes down hard. Braun Strowman truly is a monster among men, as Byron pointed out. Even on the rare occasion he's outsized, I'd say it's Strowman's physical ferocity that makes him truly unstoppable. I couldn't agree more, Cole. Just go back and look at what Strowman was able to do against the taller Big Show. I mean, at one point, Strowman threw Show right through a steel cage. Strowman is taking no prisoners right here. And look at back suplex. Ooh. Very nice. On oh, the back of the neck. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. What a drop to the outside! What's going to happen now? Strowman is taking no prisoners right here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Needless to say, Brian, when it comes to Braun Strowman, you're simply not going to overpower him. That in mind, though, what should the approach be when facing the monster among men? Uh, let's see. Hope you get lucky? No, in all seriousness, if you're facing Braun Strowman, you'll need all the luck in the world just to survive, let alone win. Byron, I think you should fight Braun. I don't think so. Oh, he turns it around. Ooh! To Byron's point about needing luck against uh, Bray Wyatt. Sister Abigail delivered by Bray Wyatt. But can he follow up here? What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, my goodness. Crushing it. Oh, look at the elbow. What could Braun Strowman do here to... 
up the odds for success. His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. He's looked great up until now, and it's imperative that he doesn't lose focus and let his opponent back into this match. I feel a little silly asking this, given that there is probably no good answer, but Corey, how do you beat Braun Strowman? Well, you're right, Cole. That is a silly question, because there's no blueprint when it comes to... The monster among men picks his opponent up. Oh, Braun Strowman slamming into the mat. He might have just ended this. Byron, Corey suggests trying to chop Braun Strowman down to size as a possible strategy against the monster. Incredible power. Don't do this. What a drop to the outside. That could be it, guys. That is exactly what Braun Strowman needed. A striking blow. It's starting to look bleak for him now. At this point, his confidence has to be at zero. Well, on the plus side, he's not the only one in that ring struggling for air right now. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. He's making a statement here with this attack. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. Strowman. This is not going to be good at all. Oh, my gosh, from what heights. That should do it. That just echoed throughout this entire arena. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. That's it. The final elimination. This one's over. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Check them out here. Look at him go. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here. Grueling victory here in this elimination match. To run the gamut like we just saw here tonight is among the toughest things a WWE competitor can do. Don't adjust your TV.